Hello viewers, in this video I'm going to show you how to make lamb meat, grilled lamb meat. It's called Asun, but Asun not using goats, it's Asun using lamb. And where do lamb come from? Sheep, as we all know, lamb is sheep. So I'm going to make making lamb, grilled lamb, because I love lamb, and you might want to be thinking, ah, what can I do with lamb? It's not a popular food, it's not popular, you know, I, I don't like it anymore. But if you follow my steps on how to make this lamb um, a meal, you're going to love it. You're going to love it. So see you shortly and enjoy my video soon with this lamb so what i'm going to be doing first is to cut it and also cook it as well before i grill it with all the um, ingredients um, i'm going to be using so let's get started right i'm just going to cut that this is leg of lamb you can see how meaty it is lovely i'm going to be cutting the leg of lamb Lovely meat. There we go. Be throwing that in the bowl. So you can see, it tastes. It has this unique taste that uh, I mean, you would love. Right. So it's ready now. It's all been skinned. <laughs> um, so I've, I've actually um, cut all the meat out of the bone. So I'm left with the bone now. So. Now this is the meat, so um, what I'm going to be doing is to be cooking the meat and grilling the meat and using it to make a soup. See you shortly. Thanks. And what I'm going to be doing is just to cook my lamb meat now. So I'm going to pour that into the pot. Chicken condiments, I'm going to be adding some chicken condiments to it. So I'm just going to put one tablespoon of it. One teaspoon, one tablespoon of uh, thyme to that of my um, multi-purpose seasoning which is tropical multi-purpose seasoning it has coriander cinnamon not in yeah, so that so I'm just gonna add some chopped onions yeah I'm gonna be adding some garlic as well Just gives it that flavor. Add a bit of water to that. What we're talking about? 75 ml of water. Just add a bit, and you just mix that together, and you just cover to keep for 10 minutes. So what I'm going to do? I'm just going to mix everything together because lamb is a very soft meat. Um, don't want to, you don't want to overcook it, so you just want to like cook it slightly. Um, but it's quite different from beef and um, goat meat. Goat meat is stronger, you know. But for lamb meat, they're very, very tender. So yeah, so just cover that for 10 minutes. Allow that to cook, and all the sauce going inside, so marinate inside, which is great. So I'm gonna allow that to cook for. 10 minutes right it's been over for 10 minutes now what I'm going to do is just to um, turn that off and drain this aside now this then goes into the oven <clears throat> I'm just gonna use my drainer here. I'm just gonna drain it everything is drained now so this is the meat now I'm going to put this in the oven in the tray and that goes into the grill for another 15 minutes and of which after 15 to 20 minutes I'm going to bring them out so, so what I'm going to do I'm going to just going to transfer that into the tray and this goes into the oven while I prepare my set this goes into the oven for 15 to 20 minutes set I'm going to set it to 6 which is the grill and 200 um, I've kind of chopped my yellow pepper, red pepper which I'm going to use to garnish my lamb, my lamb meat, my grilled lamb meat um, what I want to do is just to blend my two scotch bonnets I'm going to put that in my mini blender there and um, just to get that going so I'm just going to so that's it, I've chopped my squirt on it, so this is what I'm going to be adding. Mm. 
Right, it's over 10 minutes now, so I just want to check. Brilliant. Oh, beautiful. Very beautiful. Turn it around because it's fully grilled now for another 10, 10 minutes. Fantastic. Turn it back and yeah, wait for another 10 minutes. 10 minutes now, so what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna take take uh, bring the lamb meat out. I'll just turn this off, turn it off. I'm just bring the lovely lamb meat as you can see. So I've got um, two tablespoons of uh, oil there. And I'm just going to pour my my onions. I'm going to pour some of my red pepper. I'm going to pour my yellow pepper as well. And my green pepper. Put all my onions in there. And I'm just going to stir. I allow this to fry for three minutes. Whenever we stop, this has all the salt and all the maggi and everything and all the seasoning in. So I'm just going to put three spoons of that. And just mix. Wow, can you see that? That is sizzling. Seriously sizzling. Fantastic. So, final stage. This is when I'm gonna add all my asun. And allow it to fry together. That spice. How do you want that? Minutes. At this point, um, what I want to do is to also to add finally my dried rosemary, sprinkle that on it. it, gives you this lovely, lovely smell. Rosemary is really nice, so I put my dried rosemary on it. Mm. That's been fine for five minutes and that's it. Um, so thank you for watching and um, hope to see you in the next video. I'm sure you must have enjoyed watching my Asun lamb video. I mean the lamb meat video. Um, yeah, it's, it's lovely, it's grilled, fried and I'm sure you, if you like this you're going to enjoy it. Just as we say I did enjoy my meal. Um, yes, I want to say thank you for watching. Please subscribe to this video. Um, give me a like and thumb up. If you can enjoy your video, please go down the great. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Till then, I want to say thank you. Adieu.